and welcome to Southeast Ohio Solar Haven today. How are we today? Well, here lately I've been asked a few questions about what do I really use for monitoring devices on my solar setup here on this channel here, <laughs> Southeast Ohio Solar Haven, just in case you need a reminder of it. And, well, here's the key ingredient right here. Walmart. You can go to Walmart and get these ONN tablets with Android. I'll show you specs on the back here. This is uh, 8 inch, the smaller ones, you know, 2 gigahertz uh, octa core processor, you know, 2 gig of RAM, 32 gigabyte of storage. It does the job, as you can see right here by the specs. I mean, yes, they're tablets, but they got Bluetooth. Now, this one up here is a 10-inch tablet. I caught that one on sale uh, a couple years ago and picked it up. But most of the time, you can catch these on sale for like $39, $49 if you're smart. You know, keep an eye on things. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, they run the Victron Power apps just fine. I can keep an eye on my main. This is my main uh, battery bank. Uh, for the uh, big setup on this right here and as you can see I'm consuming 1800 plus watts and bringing in power the batteries are topped off you know so and then this is the small uh, setup but as you can see here this is the little baby setup here in the corner the MPP uh, 100 100 volt 30 amp uh, Victron smart charge controller and this is how I keep an eye on things now I do have this other one here you know keeps an eye on the big main battery bank kind of my go-to thing but anyway a lot of people ask well the biggest question has been this one because they wonder how I am able to get on here you know that's the one charge controller but how I'm able to get on here and monitor all my midnights. Well, let's close this app out. I'll shut it down. And here's the app. I'll get close to it. It's called the Classic App. Now, if you go to your Google uh, Play Store or whatever, it's a free app. Once you install it, you know, please make sure the Midnight Solar Local app's not running. Now, what they mean by that is, is they've got a control program. Uh, through midnight the classic app where you have that's the program that you can only use to physically make any changes this program won't let you physically make any changes all this is is basically an app to monitor your devices so once you get your devices in you'll go up here at this corner here and as you can see you can bring it down you can see solar one two three four those are all your different charge controllers once you have them programmed into your network you can go to a part inside there I believe will be in your settings yeah you go to your settings up here now if you go up here and then you scroll this up it might not show it. I don't remember. Yeah, see right here it says System View Enabled. That allows you to combine all your charge controllers power output and let you know what's going on. And you can sit here and uh, look at your daily logs and see what my dailies are doing. Uh, let's see here. Daily log calendar. As you can see, it takes a sec. Oh, I gotta click on system to get it going because I close it out. And it brings up the kilowatt hours per day that uh, you're doing on average. Here lately, it hasn't been averaging out well because it's been kind of cloudy here and rainy. So, got some low numbers going on there. You get a bright day, you can get built back up there. But yes, this is how I. Uh, right there this is how I monitor a lot of my equipment and I, I monitor it live this way it's the same way now this is the 10 inch uh, tablet and these are the 8 inch tablets so you can see the difference in size uh, the 10 inch I think is a little more powerful of a uh, 
tablet but these right here will even work this app also so it's not an issue but yes I, I use the uh, Victron uh, app on these to uh, monitor uh, this is the solar charge controller and this this is the battery monitor um, thing with the shunt I can't remember what it's called but yeah that's what I use on that and you can use separate uh, tablets on that and I actually both of them I can use this I can watch the same thing on this uh, each one but not at the same time because of the way the app is so I have to use separate tablets and uh, yes it's kind of you know you look at it and say well isn't that kind of expensive you know 39 49 whatever 69 dollars yeah yeah but it's cheaper than building a computer and they're wireless uh, you know now I do keep them plugged in as you can see right here I keep their power cables plugged in uh, they stay charged 100% of the time it doesn't seem to hurt the batteries this one I've had well over a couple years and it's been not an issue uh, these are eh, less than a year old and I've not had a problem with them whatsoever so yeah if, if you're wondering uh, you know a cheap way to monitor your systems uh, especially if you've got um, the midnight charge controllers on a net on, on your home network and it's wireless you can connect up wireless that's how how it's done through Ethernet to your uh, network switches or whatever and you got them all on there to your router and everything to where you can monitor and change things with your computer this is the way to go um, other than that for other solar charge controller devices especially if you're on, uh, on the uh, Victron stuff this is like the perfect way in my honest opinion to monitor those devices and cheap and quick and easy but anyway once again I just wanted to you know drop a easy thing there for you people to understand maybe you know an idea for y'all for monitoring if you wondering how to do that maybe maybe this will help so yeah once again I like to thank you for you know subscribing to my channel once again you, you can click on watch different videos and like I always say there's that click like and subscribe down there the more likes the more my video gets out and I'm a bell notifications if you want to you know get notified of my videos and everything and if you go to my home page right there in the corner there it is people's been asking about it so I thought I would do a video to let you see it for once because people keep asking me and they get confused anyway thanks for watching stay tuned um, I'm hopefully going to get some more video ideas out there, kind of bending on a blah. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Click like and subscribe. Once again, it only hurt once. Thanks, ladies and, and guys out there for watching. Bye bye.